Good morning. morning. Welcome to the app. Morning, morning. Good morning. All right, today we have a packed panel. We got a packed show. Uh, by popular demand, we got the man, the myth, the legend, Carter to my right. Yo, sub sigma skibbities. Okay. And then opposite <laughs> opposite of me, we got our latest intern, the man, the myth, the legend. He could beat you up. He could throw you down. He could jump on you. Yo. Pause. Pause. <laughs> Pause. We got Daesh. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Let's go, let's Hello. go. And then last but certainly not least, the partner in crime in Flex Fitness Gym, weighing in at... You sound like a UFC announcer. Yeah. Right? Oh, no, my to my left is Lee. Hello. Okay. Carter, you're still an intern, bro. Oh. <laughs> I just, just got <laughs> ego. <laughs> no. I ego him. All right. So we got a lot to discuss, man. We got so much to talk about. Yeah. Except that he's not. <laughs> Ooh. See, so you've got something on the screen right there. Why don't we just dive straight into it? No, nah, no, nah, let's talk about it. Let's, let's address the elephant in the room. Connor, you lost. Connor, you owe me money. Nate, send me my money. That's crazy. Um, you lost. They took annual leave for this, bro. Yeah. Bro, they're going to come. What did they lose? Out. What did they lose? Well, money and dignity and breaking Yeah, rates. to what? Wait, Wait explain? explain. What do you mean? Ah, uh, okay. Damn. You need to give context. I, I, I. Short starts now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, basically, um, the Euros, the football tournament of the European nations have been go- has been going down. And just before it started, Nate, head of strategy, uh, said that we should do a sweepstakes. I was like, I shouldn't really do that. But fuck it, we in. So I go in. It's random teams. So like you got we what pick team? out of a hat. I got Slovakia. And you got what team? Slovenia. Yeah, some. What's the difference? Really? Different countries, isn't it? And uh, the difference? they didn't make it too far in the tournament. I actually got Spain. I, did, I thought I was cooked, to be honest. Because Spain was not favorite. It was like England or France. But um, what? Just uh, 30 minutes ago, uh, Spain actually won the whole tournament. So tell them, bring Congrats. me my Play money. Sound effect. Congrats. <laughs> what, what, watch Nate not even pay you. Like, That's the thing. You I just don't get paid at all. Loki, I'm scared he actually won't pay me, you know. No, nah, he won't. He won't. It's going to be so rageful that his home Nate country won't. of England lost. They were like, nah, bruv, it's not fair. <laughs> Wait, so like was Connor and Nate both rooting for the same teams? Yes, well Connor got England from the draw. Yeah. Nate is English. Nate is English, right? Mm. right I see. So So even if England won, Nate doesn't get anything. Like Yeah. Because what was Nate's team? I have I don't know. France. I don't remember. No, nah, Elaine was France. It was like Croatia or something. I don't know. England had a bad weekend. Talk to me. Oh. Yeah, lost to the All Blacks. Oh yes. He didn't watch. Yeah. Issues didn't nobody watch the sport in No, nah, talk to me. Yeah, rugby. Yeah, what's that? What's that? Not like the greatest sport how was, in uh, existence. How was the rugby? rugby. How was the rugby? It was great. Burton Barrett came on, second half, changed the game. Did you watch the match? In the stand in the, the, in the thing in the Yeah. In the stadium. No, 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 no. Uh, how was the atmosphere? I don't know. because uh, you weren't there. Yeah. Awful. Exactly. <laughs> Did I mean, the atmosphere in my house was pretty good. Did you miss a game? Is this the first game you've missed? Like going to watch it live, or was it not a home game? No, I, it was here. I've only been to like two All Blacks games ever. Um, it was in Eden Park, and oh no, like, you've gone to the Warriors games, not yeah. the All Blacks. Yeah, it's different. Right? It was in Eden Park, and that's uh, different, right? What? what? It's like you didn't know that was different. The Warriors and the All Blacks. No, you knew they were different. I'm just. I, I'm that's <laughs> bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Hey man, <laughs> what's up? How's your input? <laughs> what up, Dave? Dave talk to us, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do this weekend, Dave? Dave, what you, what you get up to this weekend? <laughs> Short starts now. No. He told me what he did. He told me what he did this weekend. What did you do, Dash? Morning. Yep, yep. No. <laughs> <laughs> now listen to Dash's story. What did you do Friday night, Dash? Friday night. Yeah. Oh. What do you mean? What happened? Nah, nah, nah. What time did you come home? What time did you come yeah, home, Dash? It's a blur. <laughs> what time did you come home on okay, Friday okay, night? Okay, okay, nah, nah. I, I just went out twice on the weekend. So, twice. So I went out right. Friday night. Okay. And then I went out Saturday night. Mm. But the thing about the Friday night was. I got back into my bed at seven in the morning. So Crazy. I, was, I was putting on my blankets, bro. And then I look wow. outside and the sun is rising. And I'm just like, bro. bro I'm cooked. Uh, that would have been a, <laughs> What do you do? What sleep. do you do from seven <laughs> till seven? Till seven? Yeah. So, like, what time did you finish the, the being outside part? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. So um, I went home from the clubs at around seven. <laughs> seven? Nah. 
Clubs no, uphill seven? <laughs> nah, they close no, to they like four like... or three. Um, really? Yeah. yeah. So that. What like, did hey? you do for three yeah, hours? That's what I'm saying. That's... No, no, no. We went back to like a mate's house, and then like oh, okay. I was kind of stuck there, and yep. then it was it was really funny. They kind of like started to hook up, and I was just like, "Oh fuck, oh. I got to get out of here." Yeah, I see. I got a Mission Impossible out of here, but man. Fair, 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 fair. So like you know, just escape fair. through the back door. <laughs> but um, <laughs> after I got back home, yeah, went to sleep at seven. <laughs> I woke up at. 5.30 p.m. And then you went again. And then, and then the All Blacks game was on. So, yeah. And like my mates were watching it at one of their houses and I was like, well, guess I'm going to do it all over again. Yeah. So, Damn. It's all the game and then went out again. Did so you, uh, so uh, did you sleep last night? <laughs> yeah. Actually? <laughs> yeah, I actually got some dusty sleep last night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> fair, fair, fair. fair. Okay, cool. That's cool, that's cool. Carter, what did you do over the weekend? Rugby. Fun. Lee? <laughs> End of story. <laughs> <laughs> rugby. <Safe>. Okay. <laughs> Lee. No. <laughs> that rugby's cool. Lee, what'd you get up to over the weekend? I went to the museum, bro. Which one? Boring. That's boring. That boring, bro. Are you serious? You said rugby. You said one word. He said museum. Wait, okay. <laughs> what's wrong with the museum? Hold on, hold on. Let him cook. Let him cook. right with the museum? Which, bro, which they had a Lego exhibit, bro, at the museum right now. Yeah, that is boring. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do, bro? You, you upload a short of the highlights of you kicking a soccer ball, bro. <laughs> and he goes to gym every day. He just posts one photo. Yeah, facts, bro. That's his just upload the side show. He's not even gonna go today. I call. He's gonna be like break day times four, <laughs> <laughs> like break day sleeping Patrick gift, bro. Like he's gonna <laughs> some fat guy image and be like, yeah, I'm playing into it. Yeah, I know what I am, bro. Does it again tomorrow. Anyway, like, did you make the museum or something? Oh, God damn. Oh my God. I've never seen somebody so passionate about defending a museum. No, well, it was cool. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. Where? No, it was kind of mid. <laughs> 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 it was all right. Oh, like, <laughs> all that. Where was it? Where, in the city? Yeah, the, 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 I, I don't know, bro. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, no. There's only one museum in Auckland, I think. No, there's no. no there's a couple. There's the Auckland Art it? Gallery and then there's the museum, isn't it? There's a museum Auckland in Art Gallery. It's not a museum. There's a museum in Papakura. Yeah, it's just... <laughs> it's got a live piano in it. You can go Ooh, play piano. Say no more. <laughs> Sure nah, how was that? Actually, you know. was it nice? Yeah, it was all good. Like, I've never gone to a museum before, so yeah, that, like I just took some cool pictures. No, even though a museum, then that's crazy. Yeah, and I went. I, it was like a date with my girlfriend. Yeah, and I um, they had a Lego exhibit. It's actually cool, bro. No, like they 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 take all these like old cars. Yeah, and they take out all like the doors and everything and just fill it with Lego. It's actually kind of sick. Like Lego instead of the car door, or yeah, like the whole thing. Like I, I got pictures. Yeah, I'll show us pictures. I'm, I'm gonna need pictures. Put it on the screen. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Flash it right now. No, no. Are you gonna show us now? Yeah, I'll show you. Yeah, show us now. Cause I'm not gonna last. Suck at timestamps. <laughs> nah, come on. I get carried away in the conversation and I forget. Yeah. Stop talking. Cause I just, I just titled Different. this whole timestamp funny stories. Okay. I know. That's, 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 yeah. Yeah. Is it the engine? Oh, running? right. Okay. Yeah, it's like yeah, fills with the. Oh, it's actually cool. Yeah, it's actually dope. But the other yeah. music, the rest of the museum is dumb, isn't it? Nah, I, I can't. <laughs> is it in Auckland Domain? Nah, I actually like it. Like, like. Why are you lying? Is it in Auckland Domain? Auckland Domain, yeah. That okay. One. So the, the War, the war the Memorial, the show that looks like the White House, right? Yeah. That oh, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, cool. Oh, the War Memorial. Yo. Yeah, that one. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. It was cool. Like, I actually yeah. liked it. It's nah, just like went. the atmosphere and everything. Yeah. The atmosphere. Fair. Anyway, anyway let's, let's, let's start straight into today. these your, articles. Okay, AI. Your, <laughs> your attention, please. Subscribe to the newsletter where we just hit, I think uh, we just surpassed 5,000. Um, one and one more thing. This is actually the 101st episode. So, you guys, this is very Ooh, special. Yap 101. Ooh. All right, let's I talk about phones. It's okay. And I want so much better. I, yeah. Yeah. Um, all right, let's talk about AI. Do you guys know AI? Ellen Iveson? Basketball player? <laughs> <laughs> this is bad, man. I don't know if this is going to make it. <laughs> yeah, I do know AI. I actually I actually buy Mid Journey monthly. So talk to me. What's Mid Journey? So bro, everyone knows that. I don't know. Do you know what Midjourney is? Bro, it's my 50 over. No, 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 no. This, bro? Do you know what Midjourney is? No. Do you know what Midjourney is? No. Are you? What? I know. I know what Midjourney is, but like for the people that don't know. Of so Midjourney is a tool that you can get to generate 
text prompted imagery. Yep. Basically all around up. And you pay a monthly subscription for that? Yes. How much? Fifteen fifty. And it, you think it's worth it? In my opinion, yeah. Because it's kind of like Dolly, right? Or Dolly too. Yeah. I'm, I mean, I'm a I'm graphic designer, so I like playing around with concepts and stuff. So yeah. I, I just use it as like a fun tool. Fair. Nice. You could type in like all blacks cool jumping off a cliff with a rugby board, <laughs> making a tri mid air shark flying everywhere, and it would it would make it. It looks so sick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Make it like, why not? Yeah. Um yeah, I mean in the in the news article, um they're just like kind of decoding the different terms of um the AI technology universe sort of thing. Mm. So obviously artificial intelligence or AI is like the big umbrella term, but there's lots of smaller words that mean different sort of things under the whole umbrella. Of the AI ecosystem. So let's jump straight into it. Let's jump straight into it. So the first one is, this feels like a French lesson, I swear. First one is chatbots. Chatbots. Oh, you're moving my mic. Let's let's all try and guess what these terms Uh, mean. What what does chatbot mean? Chatbot. Yeah. Uh, (laughs) It's it's like, it's when the chat is dead, bro. Yeah, Twitch chat. Chatbot. (laughs) Like Sigma and that. Right? The chat? The chat? What's it's a chatbot? Chat. I'm going to say it again. What's a chatbot? Elaborate. It's kind of like Snapchat AI. Chats. Oh, yeah. Bot that chats. Am, am I wrong? Yeah. Thank you. No, you're right. You're right. So, like, you think dead. like Snapchat AI. Think like ChatGPT. Think like... Meta AI. Yeah. Or like those, like, customer service chatbots. Like, when you open the website and, like, it's... Yep. Uh, Hey, it's your friendly assistant here. It's like 4 a.m. and it's like definitely not a real person. Yeah, no one's all online. Yeah. yeah. Um, the other word is clusters. A cluster is basically a fancy word for a group of people. It's like a Fortnite grenade, bro. <laughs> Do you actually know what a cluster is? No. Cluster? Yeah. No. That means like a group of something, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, group of well, how does a- that relate to AI? A group of AI. You're like, yeah, <laughs> just scroll by. AI you can programs, even read it, bro. <laughs> AI, AI programs can identify clusters within mountains of data, uncovering patterns that us mere mortals alone cannot perceive or connections that we couldn't that we wouldn't draw. Clusters so, can lead to developing audiences <laughs> or segments for marketing purposes. They help us create a program, a group of people with common t- trails and target. It's basically like smart like grouping, smart um, labeling. Okay. So, next is deep learning. Does anybody know what deep learning is? Learning deeply. Um, I'm about to fucking kick you out the <laughs> shit. <laughs> Am I wrong? No. no. It's basically like a more advanced branch of machine learning. Do you know what machine learning is? <laughs> it's a learning <laughs> machine, <laughs> bro. Honest, bro. It's like, <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> machine learning. It's when the machine learns, bro. Like this. Facts. It's be- pretty much, I mean, like, Loki, <laughs> exactly, yeah, like Loki, <laughs> don't overcomplicate it. Yeah, Loki is like when um, when there's a little bit of information and the computer trains itself to find out more information with that original piece of information. Deep learning, a.k.a. machine learning. Um, generative AI. When you ask AI to generate stuff. <laughs> <laughs> this short is not doing well, bro. Yeah, this show is cooked. <laughs> 404 <laughs> views, bro. That's what the other article is for. <laughs> now, Loki, yeah. 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 Generative AI is basically AI. So there's different types. One type is generative, which is basically like you can type in a command, like let's say a uh, mid journey. And when you type in that text, they generate different images with that, with that text. Um, mm. Another version of this that I actually got to play with, pause, um, was. Um, it's a program called Lemonade with like AI in the middle, so instead of Lemonade, and it basically it it generates beats for you, so you can like mm. select the key, mm. select That's the crazy. BPM, and it generates different beats for you. Produces, I have the program. This is a cook. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's cool. Um, and a bunch of other terms. Anyways, like AI, you know, like it's it's got. What do you guys think GPT stands for? I heard it, but I forgot it. You know. Chat GPT. So G is. I'm gonna. I was gonna say something. Crazy. GPT. Wait, did it say it? No. We need something to make this fucking. What does GPT <laughs> stand for? Daesh. No, I don't put it on the spot, it. bro. G. What's G? Gangster. Generative. Generative. Yeah. Yeah. P. Gangster. 
P, P. Post, Diddy. Post your meds. No. <laughs> it's um, no, what was it? Was it pre pre trained? I think. Okay. Uh, um, is, is that PNT or is that and T is transformative? I think. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Why are you going to ask the question? We don't. Generative pre training transformer. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <I'm laughs> my hands are off. Off, 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 off. So, is that like transformers and like. It's kind of an AI. It's generating. Basically, what it means is that it's generating <laughs> stuff off pre trained models from it's being taught. <laughs> Shut up, God damn, rap. It transforms it into something new. <laughs> like, you know, just like. Yo, what that, was the sound? That was Optimus Prime. Yo, that was crazy. Oh. Was it Transformers? <laughs> <laughs> what? To? No. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, next article. Okay. Um, I did not read. This. Let's uh, let's move on to the next article. Um, it's from your attention, please. Newsletter, subscribe. Thank you. Um, it's about stop. The title goes: Stop chasing trends and do this instead. So I think mm. a lot of us can mm. like identify a lot of brands that have like no deeper level or no deeper meaning that are just kind of like chasing the newest trend, newest trend, newest trend, and mm -hmm. they are watering their brand and mm -hmm. brand image with doing that. So what yeah. what should you do rather than just like chase the next trend? Follow cult cultural relevant topics. What that mean? Um Lee, what does that mean? Um, well, cultural relevant means something that's like, you don't follow a trend because, you know, trends are, you know, day to day, right? So they always change. So there's no point mm. because it's never going to change the same. It's never going to change the same. It's never going to be the same regardless, mm. whatever you do. So you can't keep up, but you can still stay educated, I guess, on what's happening and yep. then create your content based on knowing what's going on you know yeah just like i don't know if you guys know about what happened yesterday in america what happened but wait, wait, what happened some yesterday? person definitely Stuff got happened. a little bit harmed who? right wait, what yeah. do you mean it was a yeah, little who? bit, what, it was it was a bit. What happened? there's um a certain like election that may be happening in america and there's a there's a man that may be involved what do you mean he's like yeah, he's kind of orange yeah he's carter said that not me he's not I, I'm, I'm, I'm you know he's it. He he does this like I, like you know Whoa. okay. What do you mean? Whoa! I mean <laughs> that. Whoa! Yeah, like he's you know black lives. Anyway. Nah, yo, yo. <laughs> well, I'm tr I'm trying. Cut. <laughs> Cut, please, David. Cut that out, David. <laughs> David, you have to save this. Don't let him. Please, David. Oh man, I no no. So sorry, what were you saying? But like what you being the... educated on that happening, right? Yes, makes you in a way culturally relevant to understanding what's you know going on in the world but that's was why i think i'm i could be completely wrong like my favorite yeah. tiktoker there's tony i don't want to pronounce his name because i fucking suck. bro the one where he says many man yeah, yeah. He, he made a video about it two hours after it happened yeah it he does funny. it he does it all the time whenever something happens like that in the media he jumps on it instantly he'll get five million views mm. It's the best way to. But get... doesn't that defeat the purpose of what we're saying? We're saying don't chase trends, and this guy. <laughs> chasing trends. No, he's jumping. On, he's not chasing trends. He's jumping on. He's jumping on cultural relevant. Morning, time. morning, welcome to the that. Um, that's the yeah. That's the second uh, lesson. It's called create, don't react. Instead of chasing every fleeting trend in hopes of being relevant, identify and tap into certain significant cultural moments that align with your brand's values. Mm. Contribute to these moments in a way that feels authentic. It adds value to the ongoing conversation. That's so exactly right. what he does. My fault. Like per he does it perfectly. No, yeah, he's. Did you see that video? Did yeah, you? it's yeah. good. It's so good. He doesn't comment on everything, but yeah. like, you know, he's Tony. Uh, uh, he's into his like rap and everything. Yeah, right? he does yeah. the Kendrick so, like, stuff. Yeah, well. so the Kendrick was like relevant to yeah. him and his brand, you know. Yeah, and like he's just into that funny, mm. stupid humor like type thing, like yeah. roasting and stuff like that. So I think that situation did fit him very well. So yeah. And I think with that, it comes the th like the other lesson is that like building and nurturing your community. So like mm -hmm. with him doing that style of content with that certain like topics of culture. Yeah. He's he like he's only speaking to a specific audience. He's not speaking to everybody. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So like rap or like people that are like pretty hip or like 
that yeah. that that's kind of his audience kind of thing. And also, he's also like really funny in the comments. Like his, his yeah. comment section is usually funny, yeah. and he goes off of his comment section. So like, it, it, the comment section would give him an idea, and he'd reply to it, and like he'd act it out, sort of thing. And like that just makes the audience more inclined to want to comment more because mm-hmm. it's like, damn, if my comment is the reason that he replied to it, suddenly I'm getting recognition a bit, a little bit, and it's like a trickle down effect, kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. How can you tell if a brand is kind of is it oversaturating themselves by like trying to do everything? Because we also stand for trying to throw things at the wall to see if yeah. something mm-hmm. sticks, right? Mm-hmm. And that requires us to. <coughs> dip our toes into random things right yeah so i don't know this is a this is a thought i've had for a while because you know for example for yap right yep. we've always been told that we should stay consistent right mm. you should stay consistent and over time consistency will make you blow up right mm. but at the same time at what point does you just oversaturating the same thing you know mean that it's not working i don't i i don't it's a good question i just don't know the answer for it um mm. I think it's like, I think it is trial and error at the end of the day. I think you got to like, because all of these people, like even Tony, like I'm assuming he's, he threw a lot of shit at the mm. wall. Until yeah, that's, most likely. That probably. stuck, you know? Yeah, yeah, he does do a lot of skits. Like, yeah. Like it's not just, that's not his main source. Of not just that, even like before that, like even on, on his come up, he probably did a bunch of different stuff and he like, he only stuck with the stuff that like really worked mm. kind of thing. It's the same as like, um, if you guys know PewDiePie, obviously the biggest yeah. YouTuber. Yeah. Like, Mm. Bro, he saw upload like what five times a day when he first started. Yeah, he was yeah. crazy. Just everything, everything, everything. And now he does it like because he's successful. Yeah, he can drop down that quantity and focus on quality. Mm. Yeah, post once a month and gets views. Yeah. yeah, legit. I think also like I don't know where I heard that, and I'm probably butchering it. I am. Uh, it's like you don't want to be the surfer; you want to be the wave. Yeah. yeah. So like, if you're the wave, people are coming to. Oh, people are like riding. Whoa. <laughs> People are like, people are like jumping on your. Papa, just fucking speak. My fault, my fault. Uh, people are like jumping on your, on your thing rather than if you're. <laughs> <laughs> you can't laugh now. Now hold on, hold on. You can't laugh. I've been fighting the urge for the last three t- <laughs> sentences. That's not funny. Guys, log in. Hi right. right, guys, welcome to. Y- <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now, um. Yeah, no. Explain, so explain the quote. Okay, okay. So basically, you want to be the wave, not a surfer, because if a, a surfer just rides different waves, yeah. he's mm. there's not there's no be a like trendsetter, basically. Right? Yeah, there's no authenticity in that kind of thing. Yeah. Mm. Um, but if you're a wave, you can come and go, kind of thing. Like think like the example in the article is like the Barbie brand. Yes. Barbie's always been a big thing, mm. but yeah. then like when the movie came out last year. Suddenly, it became like this super giant thing, and every single brand, be it food, media, influencers, for like a good month, maybe two, three months, even, were all on the Barbie wave kind of thing. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So you'd rather be a wave than the surfer kind of thing. Yeah. Um. So yeah, this was the um the two articles that come out um yesterday. By the time this goes out, so thank you so much for watching. Um, we have two minutes to kill, guys. Let's talk. Be the wave. Not the surfer. What do we want to talk wave. about, guys? We have two minutes to kill. Let's go. I don't know. Have you guys seen Mr. Any Beast? topics? Have you seen Mr. Beast's new video? I love that video it so crazy, much. Crazy, it's man. such a good video. I love it so much. Video. Dave, should you watch it? You got it right. You got to do something. But you got to watch it at some point. Like, yeah, that was such a cool video. Mm. I think we got to cover Mr. Beast's new newsletter. I, don't f- I don't feel like we haven't. It's crazy when you think about like just Mr. Beast. Sorry, <laughs> like when we just out no, of no, nowhere no. start talking no. about Mr. Beast. Like he's the only YouTuber in that room that could do that video. Yeah, you know, yeah, because his his concept and his whole brand is about bringing people in to do crazy things, right? Yeah, yeah. So that's like perfect, you mm. know. Like, also, I didn't realize how tall Mr. Beast is. Did you see him standing <laughs> next to Logan Paul, man? Like, yeah, he's he like six, <coughs> freaking yeah. four or some shit. Yeah, he could have gone pro in like baseball or something. Yeah, he's so tall. I didn't mm. realize that Mr. Beast was like a giant. That must mean that all his friends are also giants because they're all pretty. They're all tallish. Yeah. yeah, I think. Yeah, it's just also like. At the end of the video, I didn't even like. I never even clocked how many subscribers Mr. Beast has. Like, yeah, three hundred now. At the end of the three hundred now. He goes, "Thank you for three hundred million subscribers." <sighs> three hundred million, bro. I was losing my shit when PewDiePie hit one hundred million like six years ago, something like that. Yeah, bro, T series, three hundred million. Because it was a big deal. That's why you lost your shit when PewDiePie hit it. It was a big deal. Yeah, but how are people like not 
losing it over 300 million subscribers. Like, Three, 300 million is a lot. It's yeah. insane. Yeah, that's I know. basically. Yeah. The I would say in 10 years, one bill. God. Ooh. Think of that's where he hit 200 million 300. last month. What? Yeah, I feel like he hit 200 million this year. I think he did. So. So crazy. he got a hundred mil in one month. Yeah, or like no, a not, not a month. Yeah, a couple months. This is crazy. It was this year he hit two hundred mil. Yeah, I think his pull is insane because, like, even like the judges, like he's, the, he he's one that, of the greats. He like, brings out like iCarly, Howie Mandel. Yeah, oh yeah, man. he dropped like eight hundred k on that room. on the set itself. On the set, bro. And just to like have all these YouTubers free out their schedule for like one full mm. day or like a good like forty eight hours. You, you just see like it. It was crazy, like. Logan, right? Yeah. He's got like 26 mil. Right? Yeah. And like as he leaves, he was just like, I hope Mr. Beast invites me back. It just, it shows you how big, yeah. like yeah. how much of a level Mr. Beast is at, you know? Different gravy. Yeah. Doesn't he, matter where you are on YouTube. Could finish like, the greatest, I think. The greatest YouTuber. He is right now, is he not? He is. Ever. No, ever. I think he's up there right now. Yeah. I think he's, he's like top 10 right now. I don't think he's top. Five. He's number one, isn't he? No, not subscriber count. No, just like. Besides just like. Legacy. Like, as an individual. Yeah. As a YouTuber. Yeah. Does he have the number one most subscribers? No, he does, he does. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah but okay. we're saying but not like, subscriber count, like as impact or like YouTube legacy wise. Yeah. yeah. Like, is he top five? I think he's top five. I think he's top five. I think he's, he's top three even. He's crazy. at just Definitely building like a brand. Eh? Yeah. yeah. He's huge. He's going to, um, he's going to write some book one day. I bet you. Well, like, he needs a documentary. Like he's, yeah, he gonna, needs a documentary. He's definitely going to write, like I can see it like number one best selling book or some shit. He's yeah. going to, he's going to put something out there. Like, that's sure. Crazy. Um, and yeah, uh, we've reached the end of the road, guys. Right. Uh, if you're All watching, right. thank you so much. Uh, like and subscribe to the Yeah Podcast. Subscribe to the newsletter. Your attention, please. Type it in Google. The first link. Hit subscribe in the top right. Um, Dish, Carter, Lee. Any final words? Um, Sigma Skimity. Be the wave. <laughs> Be the not wave. A not a surfer. Goodbye. Catch you later.